All right, now to talk about my journey in months four to five. So uh, it's been a little bit up and down. I think a lot of you guys can relate to some of the struggles that I've been having, a lot of mental struggles in this phase. Um, so uh, one thing that I know everyone can relate to when you go to the doctor and they tell you, hey, you're probably never gonna get back to this or that, that you really wanna get back to. What do you do when the doctor tells you that? For me, the doctor has told me I probably should never play soccer again at a competitive level, and I probably shouldn't run again. I love running, I love playing soccer, so it's, it's pretty uh, sad when they tell you that and pretty defeating. So I go at it from both sides. I'm a PT, and I think as a PT, our goal is to encourage people and help them to get to the highest level that they can get to. But I also, as a patient, it's a hard thing to hear and it can kind of mess with your psyche because you think, man, am I ever gonna get back to the same level that I was? And I think that's been playing in my head a lot over these past two months. And it's been really hard because there's a lot of goals that I want for myself. I'm still young and I want to run and I want to play sports. And all of those things that I love doing, I don't want them to be taken away from me. And it's kind of scary and you have that fear aspect of, man, is this the level that I'm gonna be at forever? So I get it, I know a lot of you guys can relate to that as well, but some things to think about is sometimes it just takes longer than you think. The rehab process can be slow and it can be tedious and you're gonna have some ups and downs throughout it and everyone experiences it. But I think the thing is when you work hard and you put in the work, even if it's a longer period to get back to those goals, um, I think most of the time you can achieve them. And I think that's our job as PTs is to help continue to encourage you and just work with you in any way that we can to get you back to those levels. So for me, it's been a little bit of an up and down mentally during this phase, but I think it's good because I know all you can relate to that also and hang in there and we'll all make it through together. So uh, keep up the hard work and just let your PT know when you are struggling with some of those things and they can help you work through it. They can help encourage you and help make a game plan that's gonna get where what your goals are and maybe set them a little bit more realistic to what we can get to. Hey guys, this is a typical ACL warm-up that you might see. It might change phase to phase. Um, I'm like in the five month phase, so usually you'll come in and you'll get warmed up. Some classics that you'll see in here is the core four, with, which is just our stretching program, kind of dynamic warm up. Then you might get warmed up with what we call A skips. Lots of variations of the A skips. Hop and sticks is another kind of foundational movement pattern that you'll warm up with and see. And then the other warm ups just kind of depend on what phase and what activities we're working on in the session. So maybe we're focusing more on deceleration and we hit some of our snap down patterns or some of our depth drop patterns. Um, but those first couple that I talked about are kind of standards that you usually will warm up no matter what phase you're in. Just a recap today of my session, um, and today's focus was a little bit more plyometric based than running based. Um, we focused on some longer response times, working into more single leg patterns and more force production through the movements. So um, a little bit of acceleration at the end and then we always finish with a good strength program. Thanks for listening, see you guys next time. That might have been a little blabbery, but <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Yeah, I always got a lot on my mind Like I wonder if I'm ever gonna make it in time Really, I don't even care in the end I got these demons in my head that drive me crazy as heck Man, what the heck? Yeah, I can feel them breathing my neck I just wanna be happy, man, this is too much to ask for And I want a private jet, fancy my passport Flight risk, hold up, I can show you what that's for You go sightseeing me, I'm pulling my sights out Right now, stick on when I'm putting your lights out, huh I don't really wanna talk, all you people make me mad I don't really wanna talk, I've been way up in my bag I don't sit up in the bag, you can catch me on the front line Me, I want mine right now, I... Always got a lot in my mind And so I go and try to say that everything will be fine And everybody wanna tell me it's a matter of time I'm feeling sick up in the head I think I'm ready to die Party on earth and hell